Hello there, Victresses. It's Michelle Williams here from Victress Entrepreneurs. And I just wanted to do this quick video just to explain the purpose and the mission behind Victress Entrepreneurs. Now, as many of you will know, um, I started the Craft Academy um, almost uh, 17 years ago. Well, the Craft Academy 10 years ago, but uh, a, a different version of the Craft Academy prior to that. So I've been in business for 17 years, helping women to start their own creative home businesses. And during that time, the number one thing I've discovered um, is that the biggest challenge that they face is really in the knowledge and um, expertise, uh, knowledge and confidence really, in knowing how to start, launch and grow a successful business. So it has been my mission for a long time to um, add a, another level, level of service to actually help all of my uh, customers to um, really have a better understanding of the, the strategies and tactics that they need to take to build a sustainable, successful business. Um, I did plan to do this um, a few years ago. It's been a little bit on the back burner. Um, but before I explain the reason for that, I just have a confession to make to you. Now, I've been a little bit scared about doing a Facebook Live. Um, and so rather than doing Facebook Lives, I've actually done a few, I filmed a few videos at the end of last year um, in my new YouTube channel, Victorious Entrepreneurs. But I need to confess, they are awful. And the reason that they are awful is because I'm not being myself. Um, and the reason that I'm not being myself um, is because I've been trying to hide something from you, something really big, which I'm actually going to confess to you now. Um, and the reason that I'm confessing is because I, I've been given some advice some, from some amazing entrepreneurs. I was at Chris Ducker's Youpreneur Summit um, at the end of last year, and I got some amazing advice from uh, not only Chris, but all of the key speakers there. And also I connected with a couple of other um, really fabulous uh, entrepreneurs, including Joanne Sweeney and um, Kelly Bader, who have given me advice that I need to be authentic and I need to share my story. Um, the, step, the story that I need to share is that I'm a businesswoman with a brain injury. And that is something that I have been trying to hide from you all because um, who wants to do business with a brain injured woman? That's, that's the feeling that I had. So it's something that I've kind of not wanted to shout out about. But actually, when I shared my story at the Youpreneur Summit, the feedback that I got is that actually it's a really inspiring story. And so rather than hiding behind that, that I really do need to share it with you. So just to let you know that about three years ago, I suffered a, a brain hemorrhage. Um, this is something that most people don't survive from. So the fact that I've survived um, is a miracle. And obviously, I'm very grateful for that. Um, but the other miracle that came out of that is the fact that basically I've been unable to work for the past three years. Uh, I've been recovering. Um, I suffered, although physically I'm doing really well, I have some cognitive deficits as a result of the brain injury because the part of my brain that was affected was the, uh, the frontal lobe, which is respect, uh, responsible for executive processing. So that part of the brain deals with uh, things like planning, organization, multitasking, memory, basically all of the things that you need as a business person and a businesswoman. And those were things that I was, that I was really good at before um, and which I have lost and I've been struggling to get back. So that's kind of been why I've been hiding it a little bit. Um, but the fact is that I haven't been able to work in a craft academy for, for the past three years. I've had somebody else looking, at after, looking after it for me. But actually, that's something that I should celebrate because most people starting a business um, are looking for uh, a business that they can start and that isn't reliant upon them being in it. So I've, I've done that, basically. You know, I've started the Craft Academy. I haven't been working in it for the past couple of years. And I've been able to sort of hand it over to somebody else to, to run and manage on my behalf. Um, and I've also 
the way that I structured it as well, like I structured it in a way that would ensure that I wouldn't have to be in it because I, when I formed the Craft Academy, I wanted it to be a lifestyle business that gave me more mu more time, money and freedom to, uh, to be with my children. Uh, it's a business that I've been able to build over the past 17 years when my children were first born and to give me the freedom to be able to spend all the holidays with them, pick them up from school um, and, and just generally be there for them. And that, it, that I've been able to do that for, through the Craft Academy. Um, my children are now 21 and 17 and obviously I started it when they were first born. So that's what running my own business has given me. Um, I've got a lot of valuable experience to share that I have, uh, you know, learned over the past 17 years. And that is where Victorious Entrepreneurs comes in, because I want to share all of that knowledge and experience with you. Um, but I want to tell you that from now on, uh, the videos that you'll see, I'd love you to go over to my YouTube channel. You'll see some of the videos that I created last year. and. Um, Basically, I'm not being real in those videos. And the reason that I'm not being real is I was so afraid of doing a Facebook Live because my memory means that I thought I might forget what I'm going to say um, and I'd look like a complete idiot. Uh, hopefully, I'm not looking like a complete, complete idiot, but I am being real with you. This is who I am. In those other videos, um, because I wanted to come across as being very professional and polished, and I was worried because of my brain injury that I wouldn't remember what I wanted to say, I scripted everything out. But because I scripted it out, um, the real me is not coming across, and I don't feel that I'm being very authentic. So I have a promise uh, to you, uh, from now on, I, I'm gonna be 100% authentic. Um, I'm not going to do any more scripted videos. I'll be doing Facebook Lives, which will then be sort of shared over onto my YouTube video, my YouTube channel. And my plan moving forward is I'm hoping to inspire you because what I'm doing with Victorious Entrepreneurs is a brand new business that I'm starting. So at the moment, I've perhaps got about five Facebook followers and about five subscribers on my YouTube channel. So I'm literally starting from scratch with the, this new business. And I'm starting it with a brain injury, which is a huge, huge challenge for me uh, because uh, all of those cognitive uh, challenges that I've mentioned to you with regard to the planning, organization, memory, I get very overwhelmed with things. Um, but I'm not gonna let that stop me because being a businesswoman is who I am. And uh, one of the messages that I want to share with you is for me, running my own business has given me so, so much because I've been through pregnancy loss, um, divorce, um, sex discrimination, single motherhood, brain injury. But through all of those times, and particularly the, the early uh, years when I was going through my divorce, my divorce, I kind of lost who I was. I lost my confidence and it's running my own business, which has really allowed me to discover who I am and to give me my self-confidence. And I feel like a lot of women these days, they look outside of themselves for set their self-worth and their happiness. But, you know, that is an inside job. And so for me, obviously running your own business you want it to bring to bring you uh freedom and financial rewards but for me it's much more than that because you know a lot of entrepreneurs will measure their success in terms of their uh financial results but for me it's so much more than that because running your own business is the best personal development program that you could ever go on because it forces you to come out of your comfort zone and learn new things take on new challenges and it allows you to really grow as a person and to, to really um, realize what you're capable of. And that is what gives you your self-worth. So that, that's really what I'm passionate about, is really helping women to um, really become victorious in their businesses and their lives. And uh, the thought behind Victorious Entrepreneurs is, is the the fact that we all have the choice in our lives, how we respond to life's challenges. We can choose whether we want to be a victim 
of our experiences and circumstances or whether we want to be a victress and a victress is a woman who is victorious that is certainly what i want despite everything i've been through despite my brain injury um i am still keeping going i've got a big vision um, I really want to make a difference in the world and I want to make a difference in your lives and in, in your business. Um, and what I'm going to be doing each week, I've committed to this, a, a couple of things. One, um, I'm launching a, a, pod, a weekly podcast where I'm going to be interviewing really inspiring women that have triumphed over adversity um, to achieve incredible things and create incredible success in their lives so that's one thing that's going to be happening um, so please go over and subscribe to my my um podcast uh on itunes which is victress fm there's a few episodes on there already but again they're, they're bad they're rubbish because i i was scripting them and i wasn't being myself um out of fear that i was going to forget something so please go and listen to them. Um, but what you're going to actually discover from now on, I've got interviews lined up with some amazing women. And I hope that those interviews with, the, with these uh, forthcoming guests are really going to inspire you. Uh, the second thing that I've committed to do is every week, just once a week, I'm going to do a Facebook Live like this. But actually, what I'm going to do is actually share with you um, my own journey of the steps that I'm taking to um, start, launch and grow Victorious Entrepreneurs. So I'm going to be sharing with you all of my goals and how I am breaking those down into um, action plans uh, to actually grow, grow Victorious Entrepreneurs. So I'll be sharing with you my marketing plan and all of the steps that I'm going to do to attract uh, my customers, engage with them, and uh, grow a successful business because these are all lessons that you can learn and you can follow along on my journey and uh, learn from from fr some of those steps that i'm going to be taking so please um if you can share this video to anybody you know that is uh, starting or trying to grow a business and i hope that my story will inspire uh you and anybody that you know and also i you know, I hope that you will benefit from learning some of the steps that I'm going to be sharing with you over the, the coming weeks. Please also go over to my YouTube channel, which is Victorious Entrepreneurs, and please subscribe to that. Look at the really awful videos on there where I look very stiff. I look like a rabbit caught in the headlights. And um, hopefully, again, you'll notice some improvement uh, in the next few weeks in my videos. Basically like this rambling on not with any makeup on not trying to look professional and polished just me being real with you um i feel very vulnerable doing this but i think it's important to share it with you because uh, i was trying to be perfect but the fact is i'm not perfect and, and nor is anybody else um and often there's this impression that people are you know particularly when you're looking at you know at other people particularly in the online world nobody is perfect um but we can all learn from one another as we move on and that's what i want to uh, share with you and that's what i want to help you with so thank you for listening and please as i said please share this video and please go and connect with me um on all of those networks also i've just signed up for instagram it's victress network so please go over uh, over there and then i'll be sharing some of the behind the scenes on there too Okay, I look forward to connecting with you again soon. Bye-bye for now.